Wait a minute, folks. Let me introduce the landing team. Lutger Brink is a noted geologist. He'll evaluate our data on placement of the nuclear devices. We have to be accurate. The idea isn't to blow a tiller to bits. If we did, some of the pieces would certainly hit Earth with devastating effect. So, just as I thought, you're great! Silence! Presently, Ginger Ale and Bubbles are out searching for Musashi. There's no need to worry about those frivolous sisters. Depending on Topo's situation, we will change our tactics accordingly. Be prepared. You're looking busy, Ko. Hey, if we're not doing anything, it means a bar's doing just fine, right, Sion? Ah, Captain Katan. What a pleasure it is to finally meet you face to face. The pleasure's all yours, I'm sure. The Oars woman thinks quite highly of you. Did you know that? She must have whimpered your name on at least 17 different occasions over the last few days. Is that supposed to make me angry? Good job! All right, guys, we're moving on! Don't stop now! Bryce and Ingram are behind these doors! Stand back! We're gonna blow them! Woo! 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 Seems that I did not give you enough credit, yes? I won't make that mistake again. You savages will learn fear, just as millions have before you. Thanks for the moral support during the fight. Couldn't have you die. How would I get out of the tree? Next time you get stuck, just call my name. I'll be sure not to come. Look, I've read every book there is in this jungle. I know it infinitely better than you do. Starting tomorrow, all you nuggets are going to be sitting alert. If we launch, stay glued to me up there. Nagase? Sir? You're flying number two on my wing. Gotta keep an eye on you, or who knows what you'll get yourself into. Hold it right there. Anything my client has said without his attorney present is inadmissible. Mr. Castle, don't say another word. Too late, Murdoch. Go home. Mr. Castle, as your attorney, I strongly... I don't need a lawyer. You're fired. Mr. Castle, this is very ill advised. Objection noted and overruled. <laughs> Thought you'd never get here, Castle. Looking for someone. Where's Kingpin, Bullseye? The big guy can't see you now, Castle. But I've made room for you in my schedule. Get out of the way. Or what? You'll scowl me to death? I don't miss, you know. Too bad you can't say the same. Hard to miss a guy with a target on his forehead. You are still just a mortal. Every bit as weak as the day you begged me to save your life. I am not the same man you found that day. The monster you've created has returned to kill you. You have no idea what a true monster is, Kratos. You mean we're going to side with our enemy? Until now, the tribes have relied solely on their own strength and resources. But an inflexible mind limits one's strategic options. The demon and that child with the ice style. I knew I would have to fight. But I never imagined it would be against you, Kakashi. That day on the bridge, you were supposed to finish me off and send me to hell. 
But when I came to, I was with Haku. I thought it was strange, but this place seems neither heaven nor hell. <laughs> you underestimate me. Even if it barks, a chick is still a chick. <laughs> Why don't I show you the difference between your power and mine? Go on and try. You can't do it. <laughs> you may be the first person ever to make such a fool of me. <laughs> I really mean it, thank you. It's about time someone showed those bandits a thing or two. Let's see, you deserve a little something for your effort. That's not necessary. A true knight knows when to accept an honest gift for your trouble here. It may not look like much, but there's more to it than meets the eye. Remember never to take it off. It's a very special piece. Welcome to my ring. Would you care to join me in a match? Oh, please do be careful with me. Oh! <laughs> uh, what's wrong with this monkey? Looks like 72 yards. I can blow his head off clean from here. Can I take a shot, Dad? Getting a headshot from here is no big deal, Jack. Think you can pull it off, Thomas? But Daddy, he ain't no zombie. He's just a man. Thomas! We're doing this to survive. You know that. Name and rank, soldier! You can't tell me. Can you, fella? Oh, yeah. I know why. It's because you're Viet Cong. I'm right. Aren't I? You are nothing but a filthy communist! Hmm. I can't answer for your sister. But... But? When a person has someone they care about that much, giving their life is sometimes the least they can do. And maybe that's what makes us human. You became a testament to conquer the fear of death, right? And what of it? Thanks to his power, I've already conquered it. No, you haven't. If the one who gave you the power perished, you would face the fear of death again. You yourself haven't changed at all, don't you see? First to judge and know this boy. The whole affair has a smell of money about it. I may have to wet my beak a little. Keep your snout in the trough where it belongs. This thinking ill befits you, Bagamnon. Bullshit! <laughs> Too long have I gone unpaid. I'll carve my bounty out of that boy. Where's Pinello? We're taking her back. The girl? Why keep the bait when you've landed the fish? We cut her loose on the way here and then off she ran crying like a babe! You've been awake all this time. You'd make a formidable opponent. I can see now why you've inherited the title of boss. And yet, you are troubled. <laughs> Who are you loyal to? Why do you fight? What is a country? A soldier? Have you lost sight of these things? That's why you retired from Fox. But here you are, back on the battlefield. Behold, as I reshape the universe to my own design, first I shall destroy the Tennysons, and then I will erase all traces of their homeworld from the eternal fabric of time and space itself! Even if you were my father, it doesn't matter. The only thing that matters here is who's best. 
Remember, son. Engraved into your memory is the night when everything changed. I fell to my feet right before my son's eyes. Do you not remember this? You will learn your true place on this earth. On behalf of his lordship, Dagradai, I deliver you an ultimatum. Submit or die. Spencer, you finally arrived. Let him go. I stopped the execution. You put me in prison in the first place. I followed your orders. I got you out. What the hell do you want with me? Probionic terrorists detonated a weapon of mass destruction in Ascension City this morning. People are dead, Spencer. Hundreds of thousands. Maybe millions. Let me pass. Your scent is... different. I smell death on you. I don't need to fight you, Batman. I just need to wait, and then I will feed on your corpse. Name's Ogren, and if you've ever heard of me before, it's probably all been about how I piss ale and kill little boys who look at me wrong. <laughs> and that's mostly true. But the part they never say is how I'm the only one still trying to save our only paragon. And if you're looking for Bronca, I'm the only one who knows what she was looking for. Which might be pretty sodding helpful in finding her. Hello, Padre. I wouldn't expect to find a man of the cloth in a place like this. Former man of the cloth. I am Father Dennis. Or at least I was. I was defrocked for using my pulpit to speak out against the crimes of the Nazis. The church cowers in silence, but I could not turn a blind eye to the evil I have witnessed. I am Grunt. If you are worthy of your command, prove your strength and try to destroy me. Why do you want me to try to kill you? Want? I do what I'm meant to. Fight and reveal the strongest. Nothing in the tank ever asked what I want. I feel nothing for Okir's clan or his enemies. That imprint failed. He has failed. Without a reason that's mine, one fight is as good as any other. Might as well start with you. I was a heavy smoker. When I got my medal from the Secretary General, he gave me this prosthetic hand as well. But smoking was ruining my lungs, so I quit. I've not had much use for it since. It's quite an honor to meet the legendary Big Boss. That's just a code name the CIA made up. Then perhaps I should call you John. <laughs> nope, are we right? Well, at least I found it. Ah, uh, 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 Spider. Don't fade on me yet. Who are you supposed to be? A demonic kumquat? You can call me ah! Hop Goblin! Every Spider-Man needs one. Newsflash, Hobby. You're not my first goblin. Ah, but this goblin has one thing the others never had. The fragment? Yes. And with its power, I'm going to tear this world apart! <laughs> Looks like you have a train to catch, or will it catch you? This the toy you've been working on? <laughs> Not even scratched. You did get some training in this thing, right? Why does it always do that to me? Ah, I didn't want a new gun anyway. 
Oh, of course I get the damn teddy bear! <laughs> hey, Box! Fuck you! I'm supposed to take the word of a mutineer pirate? You know why Dead Echo abandoned Serrano? Serrano tried to use us to do some ugly shit. Tried to use us to murder civilians, political rivals, reporters, and witnesses. I still got some fry to go with these thighs. Take your time, Fleming. Please, enjoy your supper. After all, it is going to be your last. <laughs> you may pretend to be tough, but you can't compare to me. What are you talking about? The real fight starts... Huh? Where'd Korotsuchi go? So you finally noticed. You really are still an immature punk. What is in that library is not for you, not for the Templars. Ah, you can have Altair's books, Ezio. We only want guidance. We only want directions. To the location of the Grand Temple. <sighs> My domain exists outside the March of Ages. It is unseen and unknown, beyond life and death. Until the day the bell of the goddess tolls, this realm welcomes not the living. I have no time for the likes of you, horsemen. I hear the pleas of the dead, not the damned. And what are the pleas of your lord? I serve him even now, though he would reward my efforts with eternal torment. within me. This fetid air fills my ravaged lungs. I am alive again. Aw, oh, Jack, don't play that. Maybe the motherfucker who took my mark back in Mill Valley was your evil twin. Nah, God wouldn't allow something so ugly twice. Well, ugly pulled your ass out of the frying pan when we were chasing that pyromaniac sex freak a few years back. So you kept his gloves. You know where those have been, right? The name's Sly. Ah, I see. A fellow ninja. Very good. You will need to make your way to the Dragon Bridge to reach this cage. Hurry up! They are wrong about views. It isn't energy or power. It is truth. And now that I have seen your truth, it is time for you to come and see mine. Smoke cheap hot sauce. Deadpool! I know you're around here! Hey! Oh, it's you. What were you doing over there? Just a little surprise for our player. What? Uh, whatever. We gotta move. We need everybody on this one if we're gonna stop Sinister. That means you, too. Yeah. Duh. It's my game. Game? This is serious. You quit scratching your ass, bub, and get into the fight! <laughs> he said ass bub.